In nature, you can hear lots of different animals and insects and stuff, but at the same time, it's really calm, and you just feel really tranquil when you're in nature. Yeah. I think it allows you to, to go deep within your creativity. You can hear your creative voice and let that come well up and, and become something that expresses who you are. I think a whole lot of artists derive their inspiration from nature. Music is like a painting, and it's like a painting of the sounds of nature. So when they base something off of nature and put it into a form of music, you get to feel it. It's not just um, thoughts in your head. You feel it with your heart, and I think Lots of musicians get inspired by nature. You have underlying aspects of nature that I would say, such as the water flow, even the wind moving through a different part of nature to create different tones that come out more than others. Same thing works with music. Certain tonal qualities may come from the winds or the brass that go over the strings while the strings are playing softly. I think some of the best music that has ever been composed, the source of inspiration has been nature. The Alabama Symphony Orchestra is the greatest musical resource that we have here in the state of Alabama. The Youth Orchestra is a very important component of the organization at large. Uh, our mission is to change lives through music. The most direct way that we can really impact is by working with our young talents. It's a great way for them to be inspired and some of them might even end up in the music profession. I think people in general will definitely are, are youth um, are in great need of connecting and reconnecting with where we come from, which is nature. I believe that nature can inspire students in different ways. The mission of the Cahaba River Society is to protect and restore the Cahaba River and to tell them that it's our drinking water and that we should keep it clean and pristine for our generations to come. The Shane Halsey Clean Program is our environmental science program. We use this program to bring students who are not used to being in nature out to the river to get them comfortable and to show them that nature is not harmful and that you can learn so much from being outdoors. I'm so inspired to be able to get kids and people out here that have never come out to a river. A student told me that people of her color don't do this. That was quite interesting because after we paddled a little bit, I told her, hey, you have to change your answer because you're doing it. We had a girl about in sixth grade tell us that it was the longest she'd been outdoors in her life. And the Cobb River is everybody's river and we want everyone to feel that they can enjoy this river, they can get all the benefits from clean drinking water as well as from the peacefulness and calm and healthfulness that outdoor recreation in a river can bring. One of the greatest concerns about um, equity for people is that they have opportunity to fully become who they can become. And there's so many ways that those opportunities are, are, are squashed and that people can't fully grow into who they could be as a human being. And all of us become impoverished, you know, as a society, if there are some members of society who can't fully grow into their potential. I think people who don't get these opportunities are at a disadvantage, and, but it's upon us, the grown-ups, parents, teachers, neighbors, to, to make sure that we do provide the opportunities for, for our youth, the in, introspection that happens when the individual goes out and gets reconnected with, with nature, all that great thought process, these days, like almost everything's man-made, so it's nice to like be able to be in nature and be able to listen to everything you've been missing out on. Nature's super calming to me. Nature makes me who I am in a sense. I don't, I'm not sure how to actually describe it. What I love about nature and rivers is there's always something new to discover. If you have an idea and you need to think about it and to get away from things, you can come out here and just think. I don't know. I love it. Thank you.